Hello everybody, this is Sonia. Now, I come on here today because I thought I would get you to help me <laughs> do the cover of my doll book. It's actually, I don't know how to be, it actually has turned into a doll book. Um, when I say that, I'm, you know, there is, I've changed it a bit, but that's okay. I won't show you the inside until I finish doing the cover because I've got to figure out what to do with the cover. Now, when I put the cover on this part of the cover, I've got a lot of protruding edges here, but that I don't really mind that. That doesn't bother me because um, it's uh, texture, it's interest, okay? And I put this is wallpaper that I've stuck to it at the very beginning, right? Eh? Now, I want to do something with the cover. I thought I might put something to do with um, the paper doll book on there okay and is what I'm thinking that I will put something like that I thought about that but I'm thinking that's too small I'm not really you know uh, sort of sure about that I've got to fix this camera so I can get uh, how's that that's a bit better now I, I want to fix this so I'm going to look through here which really fastly without you I'm sorry but I want to just have a quick look and see what I've got left in these to put on the front I don't know. See, I don't mind that. I don't mind that. But I'm thinking, what would I um, do next, you sort of see, you know? Because um, I made that actually as a bit of, bit of a cupboard in there, but that, just, well, that went by the way, so that's not a thing anymore. Okay, so I made that little girl and I put the dressing, dressing that on her, didn't I? Um, maybe I could put a piece, bigger piece of paper behind her. And bring it up to a bit bigger thing there. Right. Just to make it a little bit bigger. What's the back of that? No. Right, so I've gone as far as to cut out a piece of material, tear, tear a bit of scrap out, see if that would look okay behind it. If I put a bit of scrap behind it. And then I'm going to put lace on it, I think. I think I'm going to put lace. Put lace first, then the scrap, you reckon? Might have to tear the scrap down a bit. I think I'm going to like that. I, I, I either will or I won't. <laughs> Might have to tear this a bit further. Give it another bit of a tear first. Okay. I don't know if I said hello, everybody. This is Sonia, and I'm in Australia. <laughs> I forget to introduce myself, and if I do, I forgot that I've done it. So there you go. I've so many things that are on my mind all the time. This I was going to use that, um, you know, stuff we use for like a bandage type thing, but it's avoiding me today. Um, so are a lot of other things that I'm looking for, but that happens, doesn't it? You know, there's a doily. How about the doily behind there? How about the doily? But I thought that other, um, I was looking at bringing something up to the front of that, so let me see. I'll put this back in here, just bring it back in and see what I think. Take some off, the, take some off, you've got too much. Take some off. Uh, where's the bit that I cut? I liked it, I liked the torn look, I liked the torn look, torn. Okay. Alright. <laughs> ah dear, I get stuff all over me now. Let me see. Fluff on this. F fluff on everything, isn't there? I have a fluffy room. <laughs> I do. Oh, I like that. I think that looks good. The pink, the pink in the background is awesome. I do love the pink in the background. Then I was going to put this here, but that's going to cover up my background, isn't it? How about on the spine? I guess I'll put it on the spine. Well, I've got this one that's a little bit softer and might bend around the spine a little bit better, I guess. I've got to fix that so the light's not shining on, so I know what I'm doing here. I'm not looking at that because look at the, it's, um, what do you reckon? I don't know. I should put that on there or not. 
I thought I was going to use some of that washi tape I made too. I thought about doing some of that. But I haven't got any handy at the moment. I've been using it. I didn't really make any much more because they've been, I've had lots of things on the last week. But Okay, not too bad. But what about the edge? What about the edge? I need something on the edge. And I don't need it to be that wide. Okay, let's get some more lace here into the story. A bit not so wide. A bit not so wide, Sonia. And I think I keep taking out the bits not so wide and... Oh, that's nice. A little bit of tatting. Right. Well, I can't just take out one bit so that's nice and, and get past that, can I? <laughs> I'm shocked I've got to keep fiddling and dragging out everything I own here. Oh, let me try the pink. Let me try the pink one. <clears throat> Look at this. Isn't this nice? Oh, wow. Oh, I do like that. I'm going for this. Oh, look, watch me. I've got a, got a plan. Got a pl And look at this. This is me tie. Oh, no. I thought I had a tassel on either end. <laughs> Somebody chopped the ta There's a tassel here. What am I going to do? Tie them together. Something, something, something. I don't know. <laughs> I had tassels. I had to plan for these. But I've got nothing on... What am I going to do about that? I do know. I'm going to cut it and stick it under the back part. Am I sticking it underneath it? Or over top? Oh, I don't know. Let's put this on first. I, want, I actually do want to put this on first. I do want to put this on first. Maybe I should... I was thinking about Mod Podge, but I don't think I will. I think I'll use this. I do like this bit of um, fabric. I don't know what it is. It just feels nice, doesn't it? Feels nice. Okay. It's off a scarf. Or some such thing as that. I might put a bit of glue on this paper first. I think it'd be better if I put it onto the thing itself because it's not going to be easy to put on the fabric. Because the fabric's very flimsy. Just as long as I stick that in the middle. And it doesn't matter if you scooch it up a bit. That's just to, to you know, that's texture, isn't it? That's texture. Scooching it up a bit. Alright. Now, I'm going to put that onto there. I am. I've got the plan. I did have it stuck on something else, as you would have seen, because of either... Jeez, I didn't put any stuff around the edge of it. I don't think I need to, because it's got that... Um, I might have done it previously, I don't know, because I was going to use it in the book, but I changed my mind. I'm going to use it on the book instead. I hope you're not seeing this, it's all upside down to you. The pink in this is absolutely beautiful. I love the pink in that in that piece of um, wallpaper. It's absolutely gorgeous. I do love pink things. I never used to once. It's all my colours. Well, things that I make, I love pink love working with pink and bergen um, pinks and greens and that sort of thing I absolutely love working with I'm going to stick am I going to stick this on here now or do I want it to wrap it all the way around I think I want it to go all the way around don't you um, what was going to, what was going to, this is going to go on the front here and the back and I might put something else over the top of it. Oh, look at this bit of tatting. Nice bit of tatting here. That'll look awesome, won't it? Well, and it'll keep in colours with the... with this here and the pattern on the paper, won't it? You know? Right. Okay, now I'm going to stick it on because I can't do it when it's not stick, stuck, to, <laughs> stuck to it. I'm, my mouth's a bit dry because I haven't had a drink for a while. It's always typical, isn't it? I come on in and I get all thirsty. I'm going to bring this back here a bit. Okay. Maybe I should have stuck the tatting on first. We'll have to see what happens with that. <coughs> Hopefully, I can figure out which is the right side and which is the wrong side. I think that's the wrong side. Okay. 
Now I'm going to have to actually look at the other side of this <coughs> to make sure that it's level along there, okay? Now, without being too, too far over, but just nice, you know, to make a nice little edge along that. Rightio. Now, the gremlins took all my good scissors <laughs> out to the lounge room and they left them there. Gremlins. I'm just trying to even this up without cutting the book. Right. And I don't mind having this loosey bit. It's, you know, in the plan. I'm sure it's in that plan somewhere. Now I'm going to put this on the top of here to give it a really interesting thingy. Oh, you get some things in the shade, they look like they might be a bit dirty, and that's a bit of a shame. Hope it's not. Although, when I pick up some of these things out of, um, when you get a bag of stuff at Vinnie's or somewhere, you've got to be careful, don't you? Now, do I have that one going that way, or do I put it going this way? Which side is going to have the best results? This one, I think. I think that way. Right, so, more glue. As you can see, I'm using a big pot of glue, thanks to Karen. Thank you, Karen. Karen Munro gave me the big pot of glue. She's a good girl. She swapped me some things. We had, we had a good time swapping, and, and she gave me this is nice glue because I couldn't buy any more anywhere. Which I don't know whether she had it in her store, ridge, or thing, you know, in a craft storage, or whatever. Um, or whatever, but she still. She, oh, look at that. Ooh, isn't that nice? <laughs> oh dear. Nothing better than when you like your own work, is it? You wouldn't sell it, it'll give it away even if you didn't like it. I wouldn't. Got a lot of things around here in the two hard basket, and the two hard baskets spread all through my room. <laughs> if I don't like it, I don't use it, and then I probably will throw it away later on when I finish looking at it. Sorry about that noise, it was me. Oh, look how we're going with that. Isn't that beautiful? I don't know about the spine now. I'll have to think about that, won't I? Because I'm going to do the pink on the back of here. <clears throat> and like I said, I don't mind them edges being over because it's, you know, it's the way the book is, you know. It's texture and I think when I put the... I might have put too many pages in it. I don't know. It's nice. It's beautiful and it looks good, so I'm going to leave it like that. Just looking for the right side again. <coughs> it isn't that hard, but I don't want to muck that up. I could have, should have ironed that. I haven't. I bought that thing. I bought one of them hair straighteners, so I could straighten me laces and things. I don't have time to do that. <laughs> You know, because I thought that would work really good, and it will. I just want to try and get that past the green piece of paper that's behind there. And get it up so it looks good. Here we go. So when you, you look at it like that, you go, oh, isn't that nice? <laughs> now, I don't think I'll put the tatting on the back. I'm going to leave that now. I've got to be careful cutting this, because I don't want to cut that lace off that I got there earlier. All right, if the lace goes along behind that. Now I'll do this one. Now I was working on this book, right? I've been working on this book since the year dot. Oh dear. I hope I didn't muck that up. Right. I'll just give it a bit of a snip. <laughs> Sonia, it's these scissors. They're too, too big to be playing around with. They really are. Too big to be playing around with, Sonia. I've got to trim all the way across here now. Nobody panic. I hope I'll still have a book left by the time I finished. We hope we still have a book left. And that's glued down straight. Is it gonna... I all often forget to press down so your glue spreads out a bit, you know, so you've got something a bit more sturdy. Must have a glass of water. Sorry, I'm just gonna have a bit of water. That feels better. <laughs> now, I do think we need something here. 
and I'm looking at this tatting, but whether I need to put that there to make it. If I have that on the spine, I need to have it coming around the corner just a tiny, tiny bit, you know, just so I can see it there. So I will do this. I'm going to put this on here because I might put a little bit of a dangly thing I made earlier for a small, small dangling. I might just put that, I'll put this piece, or will I need two bits? Will I need two bits joined together? We don't want to be stingy. I'll keep getting that fluff caught to my hands because I've got glue all over me. Um, should I put two together, like two wrapping around there, two pieces? Because I don't think I've got any of this wider. I really am, you know, thinking about, oh dear, I don't want to use it all, but I have to when I want to do something nice, don't I? You can't not use it all. So I'm going to cut that there. I hope it's the right length. All right. Then I've got my new working space. Loving my new working space. Uh, the right sides. So you do need to use the right sides. I'm going to put. I'm going to do this here first. Hey, how about I do the washi tape thing with it? Did I bring that in here? Have I got me? Ah, you're kidding me. I haven't got me tape here. No, I bought in a stack of stuff from out in that lantern, but I didn't bring me tape. I thought I might not have been going to make any in here, so I might have to just do the gluing thing. Do the gluing thing. Um, yes, I guess. It'll work. Won't it? It will work, the gluing thing. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to put it a fraction over the end of here. Fraction over the end of there. Not too far. But I need it to really stick down because I'm going to be taking it around the corner and I'll make sure I get the two right sides, the two wrong sides, you know, the right way. Put it up the right way, Sonia. I hope so. Oh, I'm not sure the person gets this and it's, they say, Sonia, you've done that back to France wrong. Make sure you've got glue, there's glue about, but you know what? I'm going to put the tatting up the centre of this because I just can't help myself. I've got to put it on there. Now that should be wide enough for the spine. I'll cut that off. I shouldn't be wiping my hands along that um, part of the fabric either. I should be just I'll be cleaning this off with a very dry wet wipe. <laughs> it leads the lid open. <laughs> ah dear, I'm tell you what, I'm an asset sometimes. <laughs> That'd be a liability, I'd say. Oh dear. <laughs> Get it off. I'm going to have to put some, make this wet and put some water on it. Oh dear. Goodness me, I had a birthday yesterday and a person had a piece of cake. Oh dear, that was a, oh dear, that was a mistake. <laughs> a piece of cake. Because I don't usually eat anything like that. Whoops, bad noise that one. you got to clean your glass. Yeah. Can't not clean the glass. I might have to do that off camera again. People won't like that. Okay, roll my sleeves up. <clears throat> now, when I was saying, because I do drift off the subject a fair bit, don't I? When you put your glue down, you should probably just lift it off with your hand like that instead of rolling it along. I found that it comes off a lot easier if you just pick it straight up onto your fingers course you know and that way it's not too bad I'm going to see if this is the right it seems to be the same distance doesn't it that I've got it on there oh dear and it's just long enough and now I'm going to put this on the on it down the center I might face it this way I'll taste it that way the tatting looks awesome doesn't it I wish I could tat I tried once it was the most silly <laughs> Anyway, that was something I put in the out, going out basket. I've still got the things to do it with, but, you know, it just might not work for me. I just, some people can't do some things and some people can. But you've got to practice. Practice is what you need. Plenty of practice. 
I find hard when young people don't want to try things because they don't think they're going to work for them if they can't do it the first time. But you know what, you've got to keep trying, don't you? You can't just sort of give up, it's just not the way to do it. I've never been that sort of person to give up on anything. I'm that sort of person that still thinks, well, if they can do it, so can I. <laughs> you know, to a degree, anyway, with most things. I don't think I missed me calling. I think this is what I was supposed to do with my, my life. Some people say they would do things different. I don't think I would. No way. This is... I thought I wanted to be a police lady, right? But then I was too short because in the olden days people had to be a certain height, and I only grew to be two, five foot two, five foot one, and you know I didn't, I wasn't able to do that. So I thought, well, the best, the next thing that I really liked to do was to to um. This sort of thing, to do crafting, to be creative, you know. I love doing art at school. It was my favourite subject. Sewing, not so much, which is really weird, because I did go into that a fair bit afterwards. But um, I'm hoping I'm not over-gluing this, because I'm going to cry if I put too much on. Anyway, I um, couldn't be a policewoman, so I become a teacher instead. A, a little craft skills teacher which was really weird, <laughs> because, well, I do like every sort of, I do like a very wide range of crafts things, so, and I've dabbled in it, and a bit of this and a bit of that. Never been much of a, an artist, I don't think, as far as painting goes. I don't think you'd trust me to do anybody's portrait or anything, <laughs> which is not fair, you know, because, oh, I see people do, oh dear, wish I could do that. I learned to draw flowers and, and leaves only because I did that a fair bit when I was working with me embroidery, you know. I did learn it a lot about that sort of thing. Isn't this looking good? All I need now is the most amazing piece of bling for that, don't you reckon? I think it needs a nice bit of bling. Now I'm going to just leave it to um, set, you know, the, the bits before I come back and you know, dig under what's not stuck and fix it. What do you think about that for a cover? Hang on a minute, we haven't finished, let me see. I want to clean this again. This is a drawing part that gets scary, isn't it? I'm going to draw it. Oh! Oh dear. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, that's not good. Like the blackboard thing, we don't like that either. I like it. I do like that. I think the word dolls on here would look good. Or something of such thing. The back's good. I might have to put a bit more glue under here though. I'll run a bit more along this. <coughs> Try not to get it on the table because I'm going to put my book on there in a minute. I don't want to get it all over the table. There we go. Very good. That's done. That bit. Now... We need to stick this bit down a bit better because it's not quite there. I knew it wasn't. It was just a matter of trying to wait till the parts dry that were drying and then get the glue down in there. Okay. Righty oh, that looks good. Do you think? Do everybody reckon that looks okay? I do. I like it. I might have to stick a couple of bits on this yet. You don't know yet but what's likely to happen with that. <clears throat> um, what else? I did say I want a piece of bling for that, didn't I? I wonder what sort of bling I'd like. Remember these little things I made? Oh my goodness me, look at that. Should I put that there? Oh, I don't see why not. See this one I made? Oh, I can't see why I shouldn't put that there. Because that will give it a bit of a lift, won't it? And then if you want to write in it, you just move it over or something. What about over here on the back? 
but I wanted to be able to see it on the front too. Okay, you know what I didn't do? I was going to stick that <laughs> cord under there and I didn't do it. I'm going to put this on here though, <clears throat> definitely. I need a pin, they're not in here either. Sonia, you're not... <laughs> you're kidding me really, hey? Have you got any pins in here? Um, wait a minute. That's that thing, that's not what I need. I need a bit of a pin thing or something. Something to hang that on to. A little circle there. I don't know if I want to make a big hole in my book. I could make a little hole there and put it through that. Uh, I don't know. What have I got here? It's just a, a, a little thing. I'm really wanting this up here so I can see it. I mean, people who... You know, I thought about putting it there, don't you? I think I will. I'll make a hole in that. I've actually got my crocodile here, but I've got this one here as well. I've got this big hole making thing. People don't start crying, please. Can we make a hole in me, in me piece of work here? Which way am I supposed to do this? I don't know, you just can't see what I'm doing, so... Did it work? Not really. You've nearly done it. You've nearly done it, Sonia. You've nearly done it. Give another go. Too much stuff to push through, I think. I've got... The copper doll probably would have been a better thing to use. Is that going to punch that out? <clears throat> hey, nobody panic for a minute till I see if I can get this out of here. Nope. I don't know what I'm going to do it with. This should be able to do it, okay? Don't, shouldn't it? The cropper doll should be able to make the hole. Well, that's in the right place. I'm not right, wrong thing, Sonia. Is this the biggest hole on here? No. Here it is. <clears throat> Get over. Get over there. Where is it? Oh, crikey. I can't see for looking here. I can't, <laughs> you can't see what I'm trying to do. Oh, there's the hole. Right. Got it. Yeah, it's gone through. Look at that. Just need a bit of encouragement from the people. <laughs> what if I could tie that on? Might look better than a big ring hanging through it. Am I in the shot? No, of course not. Get through here, come on. If this is too tight, I could come back in and... Because I don't have to have the ring hanging on it, do I? I'm going to just put that there. Oh, now that looks good. You don't want too many big dangly bits. Well, people like the dangly bits and they can take this off if they want to. Anybody wants to take this off, that's perfectly fine. You know, it's up, up to whoever is using it, isn't it? I can see that you can't see what I'm doing because I can hardly see what I'm doing. With the amount of glue I've got stuck to myself. <laughs> yeah, just let me have a go. <laughs> Try to make that a bit. Isn't it good that this actually come and matches what are the other ribbon that I've used on here? And that was a coincidence because I didn't know what I was going to do to put on this. But sometimes when we have embellishments made, goodness me, how many people turn this off? If you go and say, go and say. <laughs> Can't stand it anymore. <laughs> got him. I got him. I got him. I got him. You got to be patient, you know. You know, like, it's like fishing. <laughs> I'm crow fishing. You got to wait there till, till it comes and gets on the cotton, don't you? If you crow fishing. So, when we were kids. I used to love crow fishing. I love going crow fishing. It's so much fun. 
Was you can't get any now. I mean, about you. Very few and far between. I'm still thinking something else, but you know, you can overdo it because I'm going to have the string around it. So, therefore, that should be enough, shouldn't it? Okay. So if I get the string and I put it around both these sides, I was supposed to put it under the back, and I forgot. So I'm going to tie it up with this. <coughs> I'm going to put a tie, I'm going to put a knot in this bit, and it's just going to be here because that's the best I could do with it, I think, I suppose, put a knot in it, and that's way too long now, isn't it? Where are you? Come here. <coughs> uh -huh. It's way too long. <coughs> I can't imagine why I did this. I would not imagine why I would possibly have cut that. I don't understand. Because when I seen it, I thought, oh dear, that's just the right thing to put on this. Hang on a minute. I've got an idea. Nobody panic. I think I know what to do. Gee, I hope I haven't been on there too long this time. Ten to, I think it was. Oh, crikey, it's okay. Got a bit more time. Only a bit. Will this one piece fit round? Ha <laughs> ha. It will. Right, it will fit. So I'm gonna kind of fill this bit. Is that gonna work for me? Need a bead. Need a bead. Need a nice big bead to put on there. Where did I get that other thing from? Up here. Right. So this has got stuff in here that I made earlier, of course. Um, so I do keep bits and pieces that I've worked on before. But I don't have the right thing now either. Oh, crikey. What was them beads I did like that one? Heck, I've only got one in that box. I've been moving them about, Sonia. Playing around with things and not putting them back where they're supposed to go. Yeah, you surely have. Okay, nobody panic because this is going to work. I'm sure it will. I think it'll go in there. Try not. Try not. And frilly this. I hope I can frilly it. Um, that could take some time <laughs> to do this, to make a tassel bit. Won't look the same either, though, will it? I don't know. That won't be very good if I do wreck it. Okay, right. I, do, I did want the tassel on there, but maybe I'm not going to be able to because I like the white on it. What you reckon? Do I have to cut the tassel off? Do I have to cut the tassel off? Here's the other one, because you haven't been mucking around with it yet. Um, cut the tassel off, put on a bead on each end, when I find those big beads that I do own somewhere. Come on. Uh, I was here playing with these around the other day, wasn't I? I have a lot of big... Yes, here we go. Oh, that's what you'll find if you keep looking enough. I don't have two that do the same of those though. I need something that's two the same. You won't be able to go through that hole. Probably not. I might have to get something. We can't give up though before we start, can we? We've been working away on this a bit today so we need to I need to finish it and see that's not gonna fit through this hole not unless we use brute force it will go through if we use brute force if I undo it a bit if I undo it stick one side in there gluing it would probably help wouldn't it so we just got one one strand and we're going to 
put that glue on there and make it stiff okay and then we're going to push it through the bead like so come on you can do this and then we're gonna <laughs> drop it <laughs> push it through the bead like so Sonia come on come on come on come on and there's the hole there right go through there because I don't think I can get both of them through there because then I have to tie a big knot anyway so let's just see what happens when we tie a knot in this if it's going to work or not probably just keep sliding up the thing won't it Mmm, that looks poppy. <laughs> Sorry about that word. <laughs> ah, oh dear. I'm just going to have to tie a knot in this and tie it around the thing. <laughs> and think of something else to do with it directly, okay? I'll think of something else to put on there later. Because I just don't want to keep mucking around with this because it's probably driving you all crazy. Hopefully they're all telling me what I should be doing with it, you know? Cause that would be good, wouldn't it? I do like this piece, piece too, but I don't think I can put that on there as well. The piece I did. <clears throat> this one here, and make tiny little tassels on the end. Just have tiny little tassely bits here. By getting your pin or something. <clears throat> I used to always do this on the back of my thumbnail. Or whatever, because um, you're scratching down on this. And it sticks in your fingers. You just put the pin through there to, to fluff it up a bit. Isn't it marvellous how things work out from what we try? <laughs> you know, that's still got a tassel. Still looks good. Except there's glue stuck on that one. <laughs> just cut that bit of glue off. And we can still use it because it pulled it out straight, that glue. Okay, look at this. And we got little tiny tassels on there, and they're not their big protruding ones. Okay, and so you've got a tie-up thing on the end here for your book. And it's tassely, and it's done. And I'm hoping that I have done the, the whole thing. <coughs> because sometimes when we're doing something, and it's not working for us, it's very disheartening, isn't it? So I'm going to have to pack up some of this stuff and I'm going to come back on here and I'm going to show it to you, okay? So I won't be long. I might, you might not see it till a couple of more days from now, but I will definitely come back and show it to you because I'm not putting up a lot of videos at a time, although I could do two of these. I could put up two of these. It depends whether I get it up on Etsy or not, what happens about it, okay? So thank you everybody for watching and we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.